We take a live look outside here at San Francisco International Airport. We want to find out what the weather is going to be doing this weekend as things start to cool off a little bit. Yeah, Lawrence is here. How much cooler? Probably 10 degrees or so oh, across parts of the bay. And you're really going to feel the effects of that sea breeze kicking in. So here we go. Getting ready for the first weekend of fall. Looks like it'll be a nice one. Just these temperatures are going to be a lot more comfortable. That fog moving into SFO right now and pushing through the Golden Gate Bridge, too. And I think it spreads well on shore overnight tonight. Not just in the bay, but some of the valleys, too, going to see some low clouds and fog. A few high clouds going to drift overhead as well tomorrow. Should become mostly sunny away from the coastline. But you're going to see a mixed bag of some high clouds uh, throughout the day, too. So that being being said, temperatures are going to be dropping off. You're looking at 50s and 60s into San Francisco after we've had a lot of 70s, even some 80s along the coastline this week. But now we're looking at 50s and 60s, cool out toward the beaches inside the bay, 72 and warm in Millbrae, 76 in San Carlos, 75 in Mountain View. The temperatures in the South Bay filled with lots of 70s and 80s tomorrow, mid 80s where you had 90s today. So much cooler inland as that nice marine air is going to work its way all the way to the interior valleys. It'll be warm in spots, but you got to get away from the immediate coast, you'll find those uh, clouds lingering out toward the beaches in the next couple of days. Even cooler, I think we only top out low at 80s by Sunday, and then the clouds roll in on Monday, bringing a slight chance of showers, mainly north of the Golden Gate Bridge, uh, late Monday into early on Tuesday.